Hey, Don Wilkerson here with a couple of quick tips on how to create intro music for use in photo stories using Audacity. Before we get started, be sure you're pretty familiar with how to use photo story. You might begin by reviewing the tutorial on how to use Microsoft Photo Story 3.0. You'll also need to know the basics on audio recording and editing using Audacity, so you may want to review that tutorial as well. With that in mind, let's get started. To create my intro music track, I began by importing an MP3 of my background music file into Audacity. Then using the selection tool, I highlighted all but the introductory portion of the track. I then deleted the highlighted section and exported the remaining portion of the track as an MP3 which I named Intro Music. Then in the Add Background Music window in Photo Story, I highlighted the image where I wanted the intro music to play which would normally be the first image on the timeline. I then went up to Select Music, located the appropriate file folder, and clicked on my Intro Music MP3. Let's take a quick listen to how Intro Music combined with a, a narration might work. Hi, I'm Don Wilkerson. Tulips are among the most popular springtime flowers. They come in a variety of different sizes, shapes, colors and bicolors. These popular bulbs are available in garden centers throughout the area. You may have noticed in this example that my recorded narration lasted longer than the intro music. You can always use the bar above the images to determine how long the background audio will play. It's very important to remember that PhotoStory 3.0 applies a fade out to all background music and audio. I oftentimes include a tail on my recorded audio to make sure I cover all of the images on the timeline. I also frequently use an ending image to ensure that I've covered all of the audio. This is just one of those quirky things about PhotoStory 3.0 that requires some practice and practical experience to work around. Here's an example of where I've applied music at both the beginning and ending of the timeline. Outro music is much easier to add since PhotoStory automatically applies a fade out. PhotoStory 3.0 and Audacity are excellent tools and available at zero cost. I hope this quick tip will help improve your skills as a web communicator.